I enjoy it. That's the long and the short of it. I really enjoy it. There are smallest, the smallest of things have given me great pleasure, the smallest of things. I'm Margaret Barry and I'm the chairperson of the Mount Street Club Trust. There's been a practice here, both from the Irish state and from the European Union, of funding pilot activities, short-term pilot activities, and they prove in the course of their work great lessons learned, advice about what to do next, and the funding ends on December the 31st and you may start again and have another round of application for pilot funding. Do something different, new, and the same process repeats itself. And I think to some degree philanthropic work has gone down the same rabbit hole. That's one sort of set of thinking about it. And another is the impression we got from looking at the American trust-based philanthrop philanthropic experience was that one of the values is that you make a long-term commitment to the organisations that you're funding because what they're doing is generally not a short-term activity that they're trying to solve. They're trying to solve something that is endemic in society, maybe has long-term impacts on the people who experience whatever kind of exclusion or disadvantage it is and therefore a three-year or four-year something is going to be a drop in the ocean. I was very fortunate to get a job in the first European Poverty Programme in 1976. I had had an interest in community development, but there was very little to learn at that time. There was a very part-time course, and then there was about a six-week something in UCD when I was there, and that was it. And the first Poverty Programme, however, introduced me to both the kind of politics and potential of community development and what it might achieve. It was less strong, I think, on the econ economic context in which we were working, but it was very strong on local participation and, and direction, indeed, of what the focus of work would be. I enjoy it. That's the long and the short of it. I really enjoy it. There are smallest, the smallest of things have given me great pleasure, the smallest of things. One was that in, in, in negotiating a contract with the organisations when Hope and Ambition began, we were able to include the work that the organisations wanted to do in the contract. So we didn't write their work programme. They wrote it in conjunction with Liz's advice. And I just thought that is so spot on for organisations to be able to say, having thought, listened, to, this is what they're about, the Mount Street Club Trust, this is what we want to do, this is how it comes together, and let's write it down. And I just thought that was remarkable. The trustees that are there now are the beneficiaries of the sale of a property that the Mount Street Club bought many years ago and sold at the height of the Celtic Tiger boom just before the crash. So we're, that's the money we have and we hope to invite funding partners in the next while and that would mean that we could not just spend down but rather develop and expand the role we have um, over a longer period. Not necessarily make a big, big programme but rather make sure that it has some kind of longevity. Mm -hmm.